Just tonight, thousands of calls to police. We're digging into this gas station's past after a brutal crime. They need to leave. As simple as that. The calls to shut the business down. Tonight, a St. Louis alderman wants a downtown gas station closed for good. Good evening, I'm Ann Allred. And I'm Mike Bush. Police say a fight broke out at that Shell station on North Tucker moments before Monday's execution-style murder of a man. New tonight, our Robert Townsend has more on the ongoing anxiety in that area. For years, St. Louis's fifth ward alderman James Page says this Shell gas station near North Tucker in Convention Plaza has been a public nuisance and a haven for crime. They need to leave. As simple as that. Deshaun Thomas is charged in Monday's execution style murder of David Saldana. A bystander captured the shooting in broad daylight on camera. Police say it happened after Saldana and Thomas got into a fight at the gas station. It's a world class tragedy. I am so sorry for the victim and for his family. Alderman Page is also the executive director of the Downtown Neighborhood Association and lives behind the gas station. For the last five years, the frustrated alderman has tried to get the business shut down. It's amongst the highest single address calls for service in the city of St. Louis. Records show between 2018 and 2020, police responded to more than 1,800 reported service calls at the downtown gas station. And more recently, hundreds of more calls, including shootings and other crimes. This woman works at the gas station. When we make calls, it takes them 30 plus minutes to even get here for calls. From City Hall. That was horrific and our, our hearts uh, go out to the victim. To nearby businesses, the brazen shooting that happened outside the Globe building has outraged many. Globe owner Steve Stone told our partners at the Business Journal he's frustrated by the incident and has endorsed a plan to improve the area. Meantime, Alderman Page says two weeks ago, the city's Board of Adjustment ordered the gas station to not operate between 11 p.m. and 5 a.m. If they cannot put into practice the safety and security plans that were recommended by the Downtown Neighborhood Association and the St. Louis Police Department, they need to cease doing business on this corner. Now today I went inside the gas station to try to talk to the owner, but an employee told me he was not in. I also called the owner's lawyer in California, and right now I'm still waiting to hear from him. We'll stay on top of it. For now though, live downtown, I'm Robert Townsend. Five on your side. The suspect in Monday's shooting, Deshaun Thomas, was in court today. A judge ordered he be held without bond.